and we are live. Hello, everyone. My name's Tamara, and I'm a cozy mystery author, and this is my channel where I talk about books and writing, and I also host these weekly live streams. And if you are noticing that my camera quality is a little janky, I'm sorry, but I need to use my mouse, and I only have so many USB ports, so... But I would like my lovely co-host to introduce themselves, starting with Cash. We'll work our way around. Hi, everybody. I'm Cache. I write short stories, poetry, and the occasional blog post. I will have blog posts coming out tomorrow and some videos. So be ready for that. I got a visual poem that I did. I would love for you guys to see it. So check that out. Um, and uh, do I tell you what I'm working on today, too? Or just in general? Am I just, okay. And I will be working on Chapter 9 that Jesus never went to college. Awesome. I am the Naked Firefly. And, um, oh, gosh. I am the Naked Firefly. And I, I know, right? I had it ready. I was practicing. I am the Naked Firefly. And... I have nine more chapters to edit and I'll be working on those edits today and just life. Okay, I was go gonna ahead. say, you should change your name to I'm the Tired Firefly. <laughs> right, I'm about to. <laughs> go ahead, Dana, I'm ready, go ahead. All right, and I am Dana Gollin. I also write under the screen name Ava Fox. And today I am going to be working on polishing up and revamping uh the awakening so it'll be new and shiny and wonderful Yay. Yay. take it away carol <laughs> Uh, my name is Kara Brown. I'm a urban fantasy author. Uh, I'm here today to actually work on some admin stuff that I need to get hammered out for some things that I want to get done later this year. So the sooner that I sit down and figure all that out and talk to people, the better. So that is it. And for those of you who don't know, I'm trying to get an anthology together. And it's called uh, the Quarantined With Anthology. And I should probably have had that link up before I started this conversation. Hold on. Quarantine. And I'm going to throw that in there. If you guys are interested or you want to look at it, feel free to check out that link I just put in the comments. I'm looking to just get more people because, you know, I know not everybody's. I just want more people. There's the link. Go look at it. All righty, righty, righty. And I'm going to be working on the proofreading for my story that's going to this anthology because I was going to finish it last night, but y'all went to sleep and I regret nothing. I needed that. So... <laughs> So let's see who all is here in the comments. Sarah, looks like Sarah was the first one. She's here and she liked. Three Bs, push the button harder. Do you get the prize? You get two thumbs up. Ooh. Yeah. Two times three. Oh my goodness. I know. That's I think so. We could totally give her 12 if we. I think that's 10, but we're going to go I know. Well, you know. <laughs> I told you guys. I told you the rocks are still dull. They're tumbling. It's okay. Up, it's up okay. It's your morning time still. It's still morning time for you. I have no excuse. I'm just tired. <laughs> Jeannie is waiting patiently to be third and also to be heard. <laughs> Thanks for being here. Stevie, honorable mention. You still mentioned hello. Uh, Jocelyn hasn't been here for a while, and I'm so glad that YouTube actually recommended this to you. That's crazy times. And Meadow popped in just to say hi. Hope you're having a great day, Meadow. Hello. <laughs> hello, Millie. First time caller, a long time listener. Glad you're here. I hope that you get some good stuff done and that you enjoy yourself. Morgan, good to see you. Hello, the motivational setting. I Now I keep thinking speaker because Kara said speaker the one time. <laughs> I didn't think that before. <laughs> Welcome to my speakers. <laughs> but you were here, you were the first one to say hit the like button. So I guess you're fine. Okay. Participation award, I'll pick it. <laughs> I miss Barbara. Hello, Sarah. Good to see you. Cache pulling double duty, saying hello to the folks. Hi, Teresa. Whoops. 
and we moved up and we moved up and we moved up and thank you so much. <laughs> I didn't even see this. Uh, again, StreamYard, I really wish that you would step it up so we could see what the stickers are when I click on the screen. But I know that you guys who are watching, you could see it in the um, comments, but I wish it was up here too. That's a pair of handing you a cup of coffee. Well, that's awesome because I'm almost out of this first cup. So, mm. Thank you for supporting me. I appreciate you so much. Let's see. Shannon's here. Hey. Uh, poor Sarah, always having to do the work stuffs during morning streams or afternoon streams for you guys. I have a question for everyone. What do you think of two point of views in the first chapter? One focused on main plot, the other on subplot too much. I think it depends on how you write it. Oh, my bad. Sorry. I was I mean, well, that was exactly what I was going to say. Yeah. I think I it really think. depends on how it's executed. Yep. I I had brought that same question because um, I was I was thinking about doing the same thing, and the more I started thinking about it, the more I started playing about it with it. Um, it was it was very difficult, and every time I read it out loud, it's very confusing. So absolutely, Tamara Cache, one hundred percent correct. It's how you execute it. So good luck, friend. <laughs> May the odds be forever in your favor. I'm just going to put that I was up. trying to think. May the Don't verbs forever be in your favor. I can't think. I cannot think of any examples. So yeah. if you guys could think of an example that executed this well, like share. I cannot think of anything. I don't even remember what books are. So hi, Eve. Oh, hey. Now we know your name's Eve. Very cool. It's productivity time. Hey, Becca, glad you can make it. Hello, AB. Oh. Little is pineapple. That's yes. so cute. Yeah, and, and it's got the little glasses on and everything. Aww. Some of you guys are really creative with the names that you guys come up with. Like, I really like them. That's so cute. Little is pineapple. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Hello, Michael. I think you are the first guy, actually. So we just gonna forget motivational setting. No! <gasps> oh, <sorry. laughs> okay, okay. I Can say I say that I see no gender? <laughs> canceled. <laughs> she canceled. Oh no. Oh, she's canceled. <laughs> it's, been, it's been a long time. It's so oh my good God. to see you, Michael. It's so good to see you. Good to see you, Michael. Thanks for being here. Oh, Joe. That was awesome. That was terrible. I can't yeah, it. So Hi, Samantha. Glad you're here. Wendy, hello. Oh, mm -hmm. Michael's working on his quarantine with theme story. Eyebrow wiggle. Very We're not very starting that again today. We're not doing that to me. I will not be put through that again. <laughs> you, no. don't, you don't, you don't want to write about your, your, your firefighter? You don't want to write no. about his, his long hose and whatnot? You don't want to write about that? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was the equivalent of hanging up the phone on you. All right. Like, uh, <laughs> I'm annoying. I'll call right back. <laughs> Three oh. bees is working, but we're her background noise. Fantastic. Yeah. And Barbara's also working on her short story for the anthology. Your anthology is going to be huge. Yeah. I just, be great. Like we're all going to have a great time. Because yep. <laughs> you've demanded it. <laughs> oh, have fun, damn it. Right, that's exactly what it sounded like. Like, you're gonna like it because I said so, damn it. Oh, okay, all right. I guess I will. I do like it. I do. I do. It's great. Well, you guys are all like, oh, perfectly fine. That is so wonderful. Oh, God. 
Teresa's working on the last story they were working on last time. That's wonderful. That means you're still working on it, which is great. Mm -hmm. Hello, you're here and you're trying to get some reading done. Ooh. There's, uh, Kara put a link up there. I didn't put it click again. It on the screen, but. I'll put it again, there you go. Okay. And she's put it in the comments again, just in case. So if y'all want to check out what the anthology is all about. Hello, MM. Mm. Oh, that's a pretty flower. Oh, oh I love that. Oh, oh, it's it's pretty. pretty. Watch as if we all start to lean forward to look oh. at your flower. Now. This is my hairline. You're going to see real yes. close. <laughs> Mine doesn't match the rest of my hair. You're welcome. <laughs> It might actually be like an African violet. It depends on the That's leaf. what I was going to say. It looks like an yeah. African violet. Once I started looking at the leaves, I think it's an African violet. Which I don't know. Are any flower. Flower. Please flower. 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 That's all yeah. I can see. Uh, I'm like, yeah. I'm about to say, please, M -M, tell us what flower you picked to put up there as your avatar. I'm wondering, mine's wondering, wow. Ali's working on draft one and rewrite one. Fantastic. Evie's um, editing video, finalizing your recs for summer reading list. Awesome. Summer reading. Oh my gosh. I was like, summer reading. No, I was like, wait a second. Yeah, that's that's what time it is. Yeah. I don't, I don't that's even have Shannon that. was like, I'm so happy it's summer. Summer time. I don't have any concept of time anymore, y'all. It's, mm -mm. it's, 2017 here. You know what? I could not be on the stream with Cash because every time she comes up with music, I'm just like, oh, yeah, I know that. Song. Wait, wait, stop that. Stop that now. You are a distraction. Hi, <laughs> dang <laughs> word association. Little is pineapple is trying to catch up on chapter edits. Mm, MM is looking forward to getting some words down. Da, da, da. Amber is popping in to say hi and hit the like button. Thank you. Uh, you're probably at work, so I hope you're having an okay work day. Hello, Hello. CJ. Glad you could be here. Hi, Mary. Hi. Are you working today? Once Upon Rosanna. Hello, hello. I love that name. That's a great name. Look at your earring. Pretty. Caroline, those are cute. <laughs> Hi, Missy Kate. I love the like look you're giving in this face. Like, you, and you are like serving so many looks. I love it. Right. I do wonder what the, your outfit is. Every time I see this, I'm like, what's she wearing? Hmm. Hi, Dana. I'm so glad that you could make it. You could do it. I hope you enjoy yourself, and you'll come back again. Game of Thrones. That is an example. That's a super complicated example. Mm -hmm. And yeah. other people are talking about <laughs> focuses on quarantine with theme and happy. This sounds pretty challenging. My quarantine with the leprechaun. It's going to be fun and happy. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely something that it's just, you know, fun. Play around with it. Mm -hmm. Hi, Debbie. Glad you could make it. Somebody awesome is here. Runs into YouTube between client meetings. Amy, ben awesome, buddy. Slides to the home base. <laughs> it's Carol's version of American Horror Story with the cloud. Zoinks. There's nothing but love oh, here. Oh, Mandatory oh. fun. <laughs> I know. I was like, which one had a clown in it? And it was the it was the uh, freak show one. Yeah. Allie Cat is working on editing chapter two. Fantastic. Kate, hello. You're finishing the last few pages of Save the Cat writes a novel, and you're going to type out your outline notes. You know what? I was always told you need to read Save the Cat, you need to read Save the Cat. And I finally got a copy of Save the Cat. And then like months later, this the Bryson novel one came out and I was so ticked off. It's been like, it was like 10 years of being told to read this book. And I finally gave in 
and then oh now we're gonna have a novel uh yeah. I was gonna say if you don't have if you don't have the physical copy of it, I think I still have mine and I will send it to you because it's it's beyond my pay grade. Yeah, send it to me. Okay. You're welcome. It's on my goal list to do a vlog of trying to use that book to outline since I'm not an outliner. Like yeah. it's a goal to try to do at least one like, thing with it. I was I was going like section by section and i was doing an outline and i thought this is going to be awesome and then i was like wait a minute this doesn't apply to what i'm doing and then i got confused and then i got frustrated and then i was like this i'm not an outliner this is not for me we have to part ways we are breaking up we are breaking up you silly orange cat <laughs> so yeah i'll send you my copy all right, that's good. I appreciate that. Thank you. Samantha's writing the last two chapters in your first draft, your heroic fantasy. Ooh, that sounds fun. Flora Blues working on some thank you cards and outlining your next novel. That sounds fun too. Uh, the art of thank you cards. The art in your avatar. Just that's pretty. Just dope. Hello, Caitlin. Speaking of thank you cards, did you go get some stamps yet? That's none of your business. And no. <laughs> <laughs> this was just a friendly reminder. No, it wasn't. Oh, <laughs> I, I said it with a smile and everything. Yeah. Smiling faces. Oh, no, don't do that to me. Don't, don't do that. That's from the old heads in the group. I know that song. <laughs> I mean, it didn't come out in my time either. <laughs> Hello, Amber. Just clicked in through the email notification. Ooh, and you got a notification. Oh, my goodness. Did I even get a notification? I just got the notification. My avatar is from Fire Emblem. That's a good game. I have not played it. All right. So all this time that we were chatting, I absolutely did not pull up the timer because I'm on track and everything's great. Everything's awesome. I'm doing a good job. You're doing and a fantastic job. <laughs> Why did I not even feel sincere? Oh my God, like I looked at you, look at me like it wasn't sincere and I got offended, like no. If you two don't stop it, I'm gonna treat y'all as I treat my children. <laughs> poor, poor sensitive cachet. It's okay. Right? Don't kick me out, Tamara. I can't even be nice. Golly. When they start fighting, I put them in an oversized shirt, their dad's shirt, and say, y'all will stay there until you start getting along. Oh my gosh, you're that mom. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. my goodness. I yeah, was not doing that. I'm just gonna say I'll that. just sit on cachet and everything will work out my way. So, hey everyone, let's do this first sprint. It's going to be 20 minutes. Get ready. Are we ready? I think so. Get set and go. We love you, Cash. Give you a hug. You'd be all right.
the siren song of the seagulls lets us know that time is up. How'd y'all do? What'd you do? Let us know in the comments below. I am working on this proofreading of the story and I'm in chapter eight. So I have 10 chapters total to do. So we are, we're, we're very close, very close. How'd y'all do? I wrote 416 words that time. Fantastic. I gave Bones attention and made three workflows. I was able to find the word, the name of the place that I am writing about. And I added, I don't know, like four sentences to this paragraph. So progress. Awesome. Um, working on an author bio that I realized I did not have, but oh, life, right? Okay, I'm good. Fine. It's, fine. Fine. it's fine. It's fine. It's all good. This is all your pre-work, and remember, once you have that bio written, you have it written, and you'll be able to reuse it, tweak mm -hmm. it later on. Mm -hmm. This is all the starting point. It's it just fine. feels overwhelming, but one step at a time. <laughs> You're going to be fine. Mm -hmm. I'm still cute while I do it. You're super cute. Thank you. Love yourself. <laughs> Thank you. My friend gave me this. I'm dead now. Okay. It's good taste. Elsie <laughs> came through while the timer was going. Hello. And yeah, um, three Bs, I make weird timers. <laughs> it's miracle. They're not weird, they're unique, and that's what I, yeah, they're unique. I like the fact that they go up. Remember, I like when I first used it, I was like, Whoa, something's off, and now I'm like, This is my favorite thing ever. Aww, that's just because you like me. Hi, I said, I'm glad that you can come, and thank you, Kate, for posting on Instagram. It was very nice of you. Hmm. Hello, Hello. Nana. Chatty chat, 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 chatty chat, chat, chat. Mm -hmm. Scrolling down. Mm -hmm. Chatty chat, chat, chat. Hello, CEO. Glad you can make it. And here we go. So Kelly, Kelly wrote 823 words. Oh, wow. That's hey, girl. Awesome. Okay. That is wonderful. That is awesome. Oh, but Mary has itchy eyeball. Oh, yeah. I have um, refresh optive eye drops. I need to get some eye drops. Having this green screen in the back makes everything look weird. Like, look at that. I need to get some eye drops. <laughs> the, the sun. You have captured the sun in Which that one is that, Cash? Yeah, it looks like you're... This is a once-a-day Ola Patadin. I don't know. It's something that I got because... When I started getting the contacts, when I went to the eye doctor a couple of weeks ago, um, it's supposed to help so I don't have as much itchiness and stuff. But it's a prescription one. It's not like one you can just get off the shelf. I'm pretty sure this is over the counter. Um, I had to get it at the pharmacy at um, CVS, well, Long's around here. And it's for like itchy and dry eyes. So. But, ooh, and pro tip. If you put eye drops, if you put them in the, your refrigerator, oh my gosh, it's like this beautiful cooling sensation. I will have to keep that in mind when I'm I about to go put this in the refrigerator. Right, as I say, now I have to go drops. buy eye drops and do that. Uh, it's the little things, y'all. It's the little things. I suffer from dry eyes, so just to hear that, it's like that just sounded refreshing. It's so refreshing. Just like, ah. Uh. 
Now, now my eyes don't burn and they feel so relieved. She did a whole commercial. But go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, not spawned by anybody by any means. <laughs> Ooh, can you finish the book? And now you're gonna type up your notes at the next for the next break. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah. Sarah's working on your novel's back matter. Oh. Mm -hmm. We were supposed to talk about back matter and Lisa daily stream, but we got like super distracted by like five different topics. I think we're doing that next week though. I will be there for that. I need help with my back matter. <laughs> yep. Yep. Did I'm fine. Everything's fine. We're going to keep going. <laughs> trying to remember if we did a, a book with writer's workshop about um, back matter and things like that. I need help with that. I don't think we did. Okay. Um, so finish up the acknowledgments and you're battling with your about me, which is essentially the bio. Mm -hmm. Oof. Little as pineapple editing was actually fun. It's a small miracle. What? Oof. That's not, that's Mandarin. I can't understand what they're saying. Like, what? <laughs> what? What do you mean editing was fun? What? I'm I a translator. Going that's through how Sid sounded. Years. That's how Sid sounded. And by the end of the day that day, he was like, nah, editing ain't fun no more. So that's how you sound this morning. Let's see how you sound by the end of the day. <laughs> right. Um, I've been enjoying going through these proofreading notes. Like that's been great because it's like, okay, nope, yep, nope, yep. And you can just go through it and you don't really have to think too much. Ah, it's nice. Mm. Wendy got the kids food. It's good to keep them fed. Then they won't eat things in the house. Mm. Ali, 117 words for the new chapter one. Did a little brainstorming to figure out what's happening next. Awesome. Jocelyn edited half of the scene, which is you're turning into your critique group this Saturday. That's always good. Uh-oh. Sid's fighting Google Drive. Oh, no. 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 Uh, That's like my bread and butter, except for one time. That was traumatic, but I forgave Google Drive for it. That's the thing. Everything's great until that one time. Mm -hmm. But it's really not. But Miss Barbara got 109 words applauding. Awesome. Floor Blue finished four thank you notes. Three more to go. Fantastic. Hilla got two chapters read from the last 50 pages by James Scott Bell. I know that that one we covered. Yes, during we did. Our writer's mm -hmm. workshop. And we yeah, all I watched that. Yeah. Yeah, that was before you were on the team. Yeah, and then I bought the book. I was like, that sounds like a thing that I need to have in my toolbox. Speaking of the team, I'm going to just, I don't even know if Sky's here, but Sky's on the writer's workshop, and her book wants, damn you, green screen. It's Wait a second. I got to find that link. Can I find the link and put it in there? So... Damned and desolate. This just launched. So get you a copy on the Amazon. Damned and desolate. It's on from the Damned and Dangerous Quartet. This is book one. And did it, I'm hype. <laughs> did it go live today? Yeah, I got it like last night in my inbox. Oh, so exciting. Oh. I was like, I gotta make sure to mention this. So yes, please share that link. I got it. I got it. It's in. There it is. Awesome. Love. This guy worked really hard. Yeah. So, so you know, plug in our friends. Not a self promotion. It's friend promotion. Yay! It's even more fun. Samantha wrote 454 words. Yes. Joanne uploaded chapters on the webs and made dinner. Hmm, what's for dinner? Stevie got distracted by coffee and read part of chapter one of The Weaver Sun, taking series notes for book two. That's a lot. Also, I need more coffee. Shelby, 393 words and renamed a character. If any of you guys have been here for a minute, you know that naming characters is not my bread and butter. Oh my goodness. AB started a new story. <laughs> he was inspired by the quarantine with idea. <laughs> I hope you have an amazing time with it. <laughs> Caitlin, we read the part you left off last time. I wrote 10 words. 
Hey, that's progress, and I applaud it. Deja made a smoothie. Mm. But then you jumped in around 10 minutes in and got 251 words on a new project. Well, that sounds to me like you did everything right. You got a delicious smoothie and you wrote words. That's productive. Life. Millie forgot to count your words, but you got at least 300. So, hey, hey, that's great. Whoops. Things move, things move. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. Dang, it moved a lot. And kicked in, kicking an idea around about a quarantine with fairy tale retelling. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. I don't think that we've heard such things yet. Mm. Mm -hmm. Amber took 66 words in the last minute or two, which is a start. That is a great start. Michael, writing the synopsis of your story for the idea idea for the story wow not sure how extensive it has to be it's now 156 words that's cool i am synopsis are difficult mm -hmm. they're so useful as a reader but they're they're hard as a writer editing so close to finishing ah mm -hmm. those are beautiful words becca you got this mm -hmm. i can't wait till i say those words too I finished. Uh, I can't wait. And we're going to celebrate. I don't know how, but we're going to celebrate with something. So Teresa just checked word count on bio, thought it was too much, only 71 words. I don't think that that's too many words for a bio. I think she's saying she thought it was too much and then realized it was not as much as she thought. That's how uh, I mean. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> That makes no, I had that thought too. I was like, bro, bro, bro. Uh, oh, hello, Sage. You're done writing, working for today, but you thought you stopped by to say hi and drop a like. Thank you. Hello, Marissa. I woke up this morning and I saw your stream was happening and I like watched for two minutes and I clicked like and then I went back to sleep because <laughs> it's like it's 5 a.m. at my time but I saw it happen. <laughs> I was like oh look there's my <laughs> uh, Deja loves revisions and developmental editing is drafting that I don't like. I love drafting. Drafting is my favorite part. <laughs> I love telling the story. I just wish that it went onto the page the way I hear it in my head. Yeah. I yeah. That's weird that this connect happens. Then you reread it later and you're like, no, I'm pretty sure they're on the floor. How'd they get on the ceiling? Like, what's going on? <laughs> right? Why did I drop so many words in the sentence? What's going on here? Yeah. Excuse me. Burped. Mm -hmm said random for those who have been published has anyone come at you because you left them out of your acknowledgement i think that's my biggest fear no no mm -mm. right because no. i'm definitely gonna come as you left like, ah, you're going right? in the acknowledgement like, oh, so God. we gonna act like i didn't just no, I'm just <laughs> No. Everybody knows you have been there literally putting your foot at my like virtual butt. So you'll be there. Okay. Gosh. Day, I swear y'all just coming for me today because I have not, y'all, my my remarks and on her have not been that bad at all. Don't let her fool I'm not talking about the no no, not the remarks, the actual like just being there, like you ready to work? Are you done? Is it done? Are you working? Oh, you know you've been a driving force to getting helping us get these books out. Oh, and that's oh not yeah, I take it. that. I'll I'll take that. that. Yeah, I'll take that. Yeah, I'm. I was about to say everybody on the screen. I'm right. sure can agree. Like uh, I done? understand because whenever y'all ask me about mine, I'll be ready to roll my eyes. Like I'm working on it, y'all. So I get it. <laughs> like this but first draft is hard. hard. No one's <laughs> ever come at me for acknowledgments. I did have, I put a friend in an acknowledgement and she didn't realize that she was there until I mentioned it to her, but that wasn't the same thing. 
<laughs> I had a different problem. I had I was trying to talk my late grandma out of buying it because she's a very religious or she was a very religious woman. And I was like, this book is really not for you, grandma. Like, I really don't think that's going to be something that you want. She's like, but I want to support you. And I was like, send me some cookies. Like, that that would be better. <laughs> oh, God. Don't read this. I haven't ever had somebody come to me, like, for acknowledgement because I haven't, like, put out a book. But I have written poems. And I have had someone come at me because I've never, like, wrote a poem for them. Like, I've had somebody come at me because of that. Like, yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> I'm just like it's like I'm sorry if you you don't inspire me to just write something poetic. I'm not gonna write nothing poetic. I'm sorry. That's kind of egotistical. Yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Actually, I've had somebody tell me while I was writing the story, like, yeah, you should write a story about me and like put me in your story. I was like, you don't want me to put you in the story. You don't want the truth. You don't want the truth. Because you're sitting there telling me, well, you should do this. Because remember when we did this and this as a kid? I'm like, you don't want the truth. The <laughs> truth will hurt. Don't make me write it. Be OK with what I gave you. Yeah. <laughs> Novel Nana changed a dirty diaper, made a bottle, and unloaded the dishes. I understand the mom life. I just did that not too long ago. <laughs> <laughs> And Carol, you were right. Teresa said it looked like more. Mm. Hello, Destiny. Yeah, exactly. I wasn't awake a lot, but I was awake enough to hit that like. I wasn't awake enough to tell you I was there. <laughs> like I'm supporting with the phone. There's a, there's a support, and I'm pretty sure you got the watch time because I didn't. I didn't like turn I it off. Turn it off. <laughs> Wow, Kelly. Wow. I just read what you My sister asked me to put her oh. in. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh. So, that's how you know you're not my sister, because when you would like be adding the ending of this story, you'd be like, and then the fight started. <laughs> like, that would be the. And then that's when the fight started. Oh, like, my gosh. What you mean? You done made me a high priced prostitute. Girl, I'm just high price. I'm just saying, just I high price. Oh my goodness, my yes. goodies are not for sale. <laughs> I would, I would hope that I would have a sense of humor about it. Yeah, yeah. I was about to say, you know what? At least you made me high price. I'm just gonna, but we're gonna have this conversation later. I'm just letting you know this now. Yeah, yeah. Writing, writing wife wrote like this story, and it was the most bizarre short story I ever read from her. But it was and. I think if anybody's read her stuff, that's saying something. Um, but she wrote the story. She didn't have names for the characters yet, so she just kind of mismatched, you know, the writing group's names just as placeholders. And she paired my name up with like an elderly white guy, and I was like, I have so many conflicting feelings with this right now because we're running down the street where we've got like, you know, nipple tassels on, and we're fighting somebody with like sex toys. Like it was a very bizarre story. And so when we got done reading it, she's like, what do you guys think? And I was like, you're going to change the names in this right now. We're going to help you with this issue. <laughs> like I will not be linked with this. Well, yeah, yeah. This is a Wendy's. <laughs> How dare you? No. The, the way you are clutching your shirt right now is hilarious. <laughs> Don't that was my legit it. pearls. Think, think I about me. Think about me having to sit there and have that red. <laughs> Your face is red just thinking about it. Oh, that makes well, terrible. and then normally, normally when I go to writing group, I have a hat on too. And so you know that the story is making me uncomfortable because my head gets lowered and I just push the hat down all the way on my head. <laughs> wow. She loved it. She loved my reaction. Yeah. <laughs> Shannon said, a friend of ours bugged me so much about putting him in one of my stories that I finally did and made him the murderer. That's the thing. Well, you're messing around with a cozy mystery writer. <laughs> See, who made them the murderer? My thing would have been, like, they to die like a thousand deaths. But that's just me. I'm like, okay, that's fine. I'll put you in every one of them. Sage so said, I've accidentally left people out of my acknowledgments for sure, but no one has come at me about it. But only a handful of people have read my stuff anyway. <sighs> Same. I don't know how I became friends with so many people who aren't readers. 
Yeah. I, say, I read it. I read your stuff. But you're not. No, but no, but you start to realize that a lot of your friends, that you're just like, y'all are not readers. Why are we friends? Yeah, How did we become like, friends? Say, y'all see all these shelves over here. Yeah, we know you girl need to read. Cat girl read. Girl read. You know, anyone that's on the screen is not included in what I was just saying. Because y'all, I mean, want, I didn't like, know that. I was, I was, I wasn't sure. I was making sure you knew that well, I was a I part did. of the handful. I know it's you like your about. books. I'm an actual fan. I'm so trying to figure out what happens to Freya in the next book. I have questions that need answers. Me too. We find them adults. Yeah, I understand what Samara is talking about. I've looked at my friends list and I'm like, mm. a little that. brown smurf. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> it took me a second to read it. I was like, my. Right? Aren't these hilarious? I love these. I was these. like, what? These smurf? You know, it's not awesome. a smurf. It's a smurf. I love it. Hello? I am I am pretty positive I haven't seen your name before. And you are fantastic. Welcome. I don't know what you're laughing at, but I'm glad you're probably my to story. <laughs> probably. Uh, so you know you have people asking about Freya. Watch out now. Right. When I was seven, someone asked me what I wanted to be when I grew up, and not knowing what I was talking about, I said I wanted to be a hooker lady. <laughs> my mom said at least they get paid well. Wow. <laughs> Kids really do say the best. <laughs> the best stuff. Oh, that is so funny. That would have been an interesting conversation. Wow. All right. Have we only done one? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. yeah, we have. Wow, you guys. You you have been wonderful and amusing, but come on. We gotta do some writing. I am so sorry that I have led you astray with my giggles. All right. Now, remember, you need to save your stuff, drink some water, back up your stuff. Oh, my gosh. And put kids to bed. Stretch. <laughs> Stretch. Maybe stand up if you haven't in a minute, which I'm going to do because I need to get coffee. Refill your coffee cup. And write stuff. Go.
was that the quickest 20 minutes ever in life? I swear. How'd y'all do? What'd you do? Let us know in the comments below. Um, I did the first half of that chapter. And how'd y'all do? I got over 400 words, so it put me at 1,014 for the day. Heck yeah. Uh, um, I made more workflows, and then I invited part of my team to the workflows, so. Ooh. Naked Firefly, you were going to say something? Oh, um, I finished the author bio for the anthology. So Yay! I just got to get back to the edits and then work on the author bio for the Amazon page. <laughs> Miss Dana, I uh, finished organizing the one chapter and I'm down to the next one. Heck yeah. Did I do what I said I was going to do? No. Did I write 329 words of quarantine with the beast? Yes. Yes, I did. <laughs> They call it uh, pineapple pizza in the continental U.S. And they call it pineapple pizza Hawaiian here too, but it's not really the one that folks eat. It seems like it doesn't seem like it hits here like it does on the continent, on the mainland. Like what, um, like it's, is there a difference between it or Hawaiian no. or is it? Not really. It's not a thing. Yeah. Well, I mean, pineapple there is like very common. So I can imagine here it's like new, new, fantastic. So Allie, 132 words this time. Excellent. Howdy, Devin. Hello, Ben. Oh. Banana on a pizza. What? Only if it's like a dessert pizza. Mm. In my opinion. Otherwise, I've never had banana on a pizza with like cheese and marinara. And I'm stuff. allergic to banana, so I don't see me doing that anytime soon. I remember, wasn't there, um, who was the show on Nickelodeon about Doug? Doug. Oh, is it just called Doug? I think yeah. it's just called Doug, yeah. Yeah, because it was him and his crush came up with like uh they actually made the 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 banana on pizza thing there. And that became like the school craze. Oh. Ooh wee you killer tofu. <laughs> Three peas distracted Wendy. I was giggling. I looked at the chat and I was like, you guys, it's just silly. Mary worked on your van board, then got distracted by the pineapple and pizza debate. <laughs> uh, three B's regrets nothing. Jean's <laughs> still prepping act three. Excellent. Oh God. <clears throat> A very strong scent from outside just drifted in here oh no <laughs> oh it has a taste oh that's it's not good it's like perfume oh, oh. Damn. many mm. monster does that to me in the morning when we we're going to school she she like soaks in perfume walks out the front door and then i'm left like, like tasting her perfume her body mist or whatever they call it all day it's like i think they must have sprayed it on outside and i have to say that's not fair <laughs> i didn't ask for this all right cj wrote 120 words of an email i hope that email is helpful um becca finished your edits hey, hey! 
that's wonderful. Now you can be like, I'm going to take a break. And then you'll work on something else because that's what we always do. Yeah. A break. Hey, I took a two day. I took a one day break this week. Was it, it was a, a real day? Break. Yeah, it was like a. So you don't even know if it was a whole day? <laughs> I think it was. I want to say it was like a day and a half, two days, because you, you yeah, were like, cause I didn't, I didn't yeah. write. Yeah. You didn't start yeah. working. You didn't start working on writing stuff until yesterday when you started doing your uh, proofreading edit. So yeah, I, you took, you took good time and you were just. I took time. I think I did a stream, but that doesn't count. That doesn't count. That. Mm. Finished your day. My name is Pot, and your name is Kettle, and you need to take a real break. <laughs> what okay. were you doing? What were you doing during the stream? Were you working, or were you just kind of screwing off? I think I was working on something. Mm. I'm, I, look, I'm trying. I'm really trying. I know. I really don't give you a lot to work with here. I took the ladder there. You could have been like, oh, you know, I organized my desk. I, I did this. I did that. You know? I can't look at that kind of blatant lie and say it with a straight face. <laughs> I'm like Captain Chaos over here. Yikes. I tried to take a break and then I wrote an entire book. So I can't do it either. Don't. You're in good company. I'm going to finish I'm these proofreads. And I swear to you, I'm going to take a full 24 hours where I don't stream and I don't do anything, or if I do stream, it'll just be me like not doing anything that's work related. This, I promise you. Put okay. it on the calendar and just say you're busy for the entire day. Mm, I'll do it Saturday. This Saturday, I ain't doing nothing, y'all. All right. Okay. Don't at me. Okay. I've declared it publicly. So I have to do this. So well, maybe you're sure. working. If you're working, we have to call her out. Like, aren't you supposed to be not yeah, working? You have to call me out. So if I'm if I tweet about it, Instagram it, Facebook it, you guys have to hold me accountable. This Saturday, June, I'm not supposed to do anything. This no, June 13th. I don't have anything to do. I am not doing any work. I'm gonna learn how to do this. <laughs> but floor blues. Finish all your thank you cards and start outlining your novel, which is amazing. Hella, more pages read, and then you enjoyed watching the pizza discussion unfold. Jocelyn rewrote the last half of the scene to add more tension and a bit of foreshadowing. Oh. Wonderful. Miss Barbara got your short story outline done. Heck yeah. Deja came in at 359 words. Wonderful. Kelly is smoking hot today with 899 words. Wow. Samantha, 563. Heck yeah. You guys are doing amazing. Caitlin had an open face meatloaf sandwich and you wrote 445 words. The best of both worlds. Not so happy. Words. <laughs> Area, hello. Oh, I like that skyline. It's lovely. 348 words. Oh, mm. Google's messing up your page breaks. You know, that sounds really weird. I was going to say, every time I upload a Word document into Google, anything, it messes everything up, and then I just got to go in and completely reformat it, and it drives me bonkers. Yeah, that's why I stop, I'm stopped using Google Docs and I'm using Word Docs because you can do the same thing with Word links that you do with Google links and Microsoft did I have like OneDrive. So I just leave it I guess I just draft it in Google and then when I download it to send to the editor into Word it just keeps everything the same. I don't know what it is about the Microsoft to Google that is wonky, but when you go from Google to Microsoft it's totally fine. So like if Google's doing the issues with your page breaks, I'm not really, uh, I don't know. And I'm not sure who has the best uh, Scrivener advice videos because I end up kind of just searching as I go if there's something that I'm having issues with. Mm. But if anyone else has a rec, please give suggestions. 
Sarah may be done with the author bio, going through and proofreading your front and back matter before calling it all done. That is such an exciting place to be. That's awesome. Since Michael is using a story you've already partly written, he's copied the outlines and the scenes to use as inspiration to create an outline. Heck yeah. Fun fact. Michael has let us know that Hawaiian pizza was actually invented in Vancouver, Canada, and not in Hawaii at all. Oh my. So that's probably why it's not a thing here. That makes sense because at least from what I know, when I used to work at Pizza Hut, uh, Hawaiian pizza has Canadian bacon on it. Yeah, I was going to say Canada invented like the most awesome kind of bacon. So it only makes sense that they make the most awesome kind of Hawaiian pizza too. Alec Cat's still doing homework, but you're listening to this as you do. Well, I hope that we are not too annoying and that you're enjoying listening to us. Angelique is has been writing on a paper. I'm not sure how many words you have now. That's all good. Whoa. Banana pudding pizza? You sure that's not pie? It sounds like something you would get at CC's. I, I could see that being okay because it it would it would be like almost like a banana cream pie, but on like a pizza crust. Yep, it sounds like something you could get ordered at CC's. This is yeah. crazy. Sage is saying that banana on pizza is heavenly with salami. That is so interesting. I want to know what that sauce tastes like that's paired with these things. What seasonings up in there? I am so curious. I haven't been to South Africa before. I would love to go though. Shannon is contemplating cleaning your art table and cleaning out the closet. Okay, procrastinating. <laughs> I hear that. Christina P. I know no other pizza than a pepperoni slice, and that's it. <laughs> Ugh, I can still smell that perfume. It's like, how many minutes ago was that? And it's still lingering? 15. Ugh, so wrong. The novel Nana got a load of dishes loaded into the dishwasher, finished cleaning the kids' room, put a load of laundry into the dryer, started another in the wash, took out the garbage, and full of laundry. Phew! That domestic thing, like, down. Got that all lock. Mm -hmm. Awesome. CJ hopes it'll be a helpful email, too. <laughs> it's likely that three people will read it and the rest will ignore it. Isn't that annoying? When I was in the military, I used to like send out emails to like the entire group going like, okay guys, these are the things that need to be done. This is what I need from you and I need it by this day. And then guaranteed within 10 minutes, it was like, hey, about that email you sent, what do you need from me? I was like, I need what's in the email. What do you need it by? I need it by the time that, do, do you know how to read? Like what's your literary score? <laughs> They're like, hey, I saw that you uh, wrote this email. I didn't really actually open it. So I'm just gonna t ask you to tell me what it said. Yeah. That would have been an interesting experiment. Just uh, writing it in the email. Just ask me. <laughs> Just ask me. Hey, hey. hey, Shulina. I think that we are doing pretty well. Feels like things are going well up with the folks on the screen. We're getting things done. And it seems like same is happening in the comments. And we're having some great conversations about, we've talked about, everything from prostitution to pizza today so glad you could join us see on my <laughs> stream on my stream it's just completely crazy stuff on your stream you have like insightful and thoughtful conversations about various topics i don't know about all that we I didn't have no insightful conversation about prostitutes it wasn't i didn't learn a lot i didn't learn anything Well, well we, I, did learn, <laughs> we, did, we did learn that high, high class prostitutes get paid well. But we didn't define what paid well was. No, 
we're not going <laughs> back to this conversation. I <laughs> say that we touched upon it about an hour ago. Now y'all leave that in the past. Now we're here with Grayson sipping tea. Sipping all the tea. I like going there too. When he said no recording videos, no website, no nothing but chilling with me. And the rest of us, cheers. I'm telling you that's what you're going to do. You know about this time off that you're supposed to do on Saturday? You ain't doing nothing. I'm not going to do anything. I said what I said. Mm -hmm. um, pineapple on pizza. I occasionally have it, but I only like it when it's like the Hawaiian pizza with the Canadian bacon. Um, pasta on pizza, I've never tried it. So, so I don't know if I like it or not. Um, I like pasta on pizza when it comes from CC's. I've never had pasta on pizza. I've never had pasta on pizza, but apparently we are- Cause y'all ain't never been to CC's apparently. I've had CC's pizza. I just didn't know that, like, you know what? No, I've seen macaroni and cheese on pizza, but I never tried it. I never I tried it. I was. I, mean, I know at CC's they have it because there's yeah, a specific yeah. macaroni and cheese pizza, and it's amazing. I never tried it because I was like, I don't know if that's right. So I don't. That doesn't, that's not a combination. <laughs> Has anyone seen the Starbucks statement? I have not. What's that? But your face makes me feel like it's not a good. I, I make Probably. my own coffee. Starbucks is way too rich for this blood. <laughs> Probably something right. we can look at afterwards. Yeah, I'll look it up afterwards. Let's see, is there anything else here? Ah, okay, I see. So, okay. Hmm. Hello, Logan's vlog. Ain't that the statement about Starbucks closing chains in Canada also? Hello. Whoa, they're closing chains? Wow, BBB mm -hmm. is determined about this this, uh, this discussion. Okay. Nobody said pasta is bad, so that passes with me. Good choices, guy, good choice. Don't knock it till you try it. Psst, I've never yeah, tried I, it. I was going to say, I can't knock it because I've never tried it. I just never thought that would be a good combination. I just never tried it, so... One day, one day I will do it. <laughs> Three bees just out here trolling everybody. And then you never tried it yourself. I just read that last part. You know what? <laughs> I love you, Triple B. <laughs> made me feel weird for like two seconds. <laughs> oh my God. Thank you for the donation and this laugh. Oh my gosh. That was so good. You had everybody on a whole roll. Uh, that was good. That was good. We should. Okay. We have enough. Well, I mean, there's no one streaming after me, right? Not that I know of. Yeah. I can check. Hold on. I own the spreadsheet. Let me see. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That is hilarious. I'm still chuckling. It looks like they made a statement on employees and Black Lives Matter. Negative. There is no one streaming after you until like a couple hours from now. All right. So how does everyone feel about us at least getting three <laughs> sprints in? <gasps> There's a bones. Hi, Bones. Bones, oh, bones. Dog. It's the Bones cam on the Bones dog. Yeah, there you go. He's a good boy. Bones is a good boy. Oh. Where's Oink? Oh, she's on the floor. I was gonna bring her up before we, um, before we left. She's right there sleeping. There's her butt. Where's the other part of her? There she is. She's not a little she's puppy like, anymore. Oh my gosh, she is not a. <laughs> oh my god. I will. I will wake her up after this sprint, and oh you guys have Google. Yeah, all the you can room. have some peace before you. She's definitely up. not a little puppy no more. <laughs> She's a big girl that demands a lot of attention. And she, yeah, yeah, she's she's things on her chew toy. All right, y'all. This one is the last one. 
hit save, back up your stuff, drink some water, stretch, stand up, do what you need to do, and let's start. Who wants to count it off, this last one? Cache, you want to count it off? All right. Three, two, one, sprint!
All right. I have one more paragraph until I'm done with all of these proofreads. So you guys tell everyone what you did. Everyone in the comments, let me know. And I'm going to finish this real quick. Well, I'm at 1,253 words for the day. And I still have my stream. So there's a chance between now and the end of the day, I could still hit 5,000. And I am like this close to hitting 35,000 words for Jesus Never Went to College. Nice. Knocking it out. Um, I finished all my workflows and now I'm just kind of moving on to this this other thing that it's more research. I'm doing research now. I, uh, I got a phone call from Mini Monster. Yay. And, um, yeah, I just sat here and literally just looked at a chapter like, okay, we're going to, we're going to fight. It's okay. Mm -hmm. It's all right. It's going to be fine. So I'm going to probably just wait until in the morning to work on it. Um, when Cash does her stream, I'll probably be in the chat trying to battle it. I'll be fine. It'll be good. But you'll be looking cute while you do it. I know, right? I just gotta look cute while I'm doing it. Yeah, that'll look good. Mm -hmm. Right. <sighs> and I'm done. Mm, mm, I am done. So after the stream, I'll be sending it off and I'm done and I'm happy hey. and I'm done and everything's done and I'm done. Oh my gosh, I'm done. Are you gonna actually take time off now? Um saturday saturday okay saturday. i'm watching you <laughs> oh morgan fell asleep you must have needed it though so i hope you had a good nap Ooh. so that means on the instagrams we're gonna see a new tattoo oh that's exciting i like tattoos I like I want some other. more ink. I'm scared okay. of needles. I'm scared of needles. I'm going to sit here laughing. It's not the same. It's not the same. I don't care. I just I'm scared of needles. Like, I cry when I have to get shots. It's not the same. My okay. entire back is covered from right here to right here. I'm telling you, it's not the same. It's not Hubby the same. Hubby has tattoos. I can't. But maybe one day when I'm like, you know, everything's starting to sag and then I'll be like, oh, it looks nice. It's a it's a new piece of art. Wait, maybe when we get there. Kelly Cross 10K for this novella. Thank you for being here and congratulations. That's amazing. Jocelyn had to leave early. Happy writing. And I hope you have a great rest of your week. Uh, Mary's. Bestie called her, so you had a great phone call, I'm sure. Schwartz Run, you're not joining the game, but you have to give your first class through Zoom. Oh, wow. Yeah, those Zoom classes, man, they're rough. Maybe rough. But thanks for stopping in and saying hi. I appreciate you. Yeah. Guns of Paradise just came on. Well, I've never watched it. Have y'all watched it before? No. Uh -huh. I, I hope you enjoy it. Mmm. White peach juice sounds refreshing, Miss Barbara. It does. Sage has been trying to find the famed live stream schedule because now that I have a regular screen, I should it should be down in the description. So check that out. And if it's not then I guess I uh, care or Kara, do you want to put a link for it yeah. in the comments? Yeah. And if you want to get added to it, the easiest thing to do is just to shoot me a message on Facebook. Sometimes I have people like send it to me on Twitter and I'm like, no, it's okay. I don't go to Twitter very often. I really don't. <laughs> uh, let's see. Three people get me about the tattoo thing. See. <laughs> There are also people who haven't got tattoos. You got to listen to the people who are scared of needles but have tattoos. Littlest Pineapple says that they have a tattoo. No, they don't. They said oh. the permanent is I'm rereading. I'm reading. I'm reading. I just said I'm reading. <laughs> I meant sit. So let's go up above sit. 
said. But, and, but read the sins. Did you reread what he said? That he has tattoos, but he's scared of needles. It's not the same. Like I said, I know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm going to keep going because we're over time and y'all can finish your argument later. So, Becca, Becca, uh, unpacking is the worst but being done with packing and being done moving is the best i hope you enjoy your new place mm-hmm. wendy really wants to read that story cachet yeah i said when i'm looking for beta readers i would definitely keep her in mind mm-hmm. marissa finished an essay for medium tomorrow and now you're doing some video editing i've been thinking about medium but i'm not sure Area wrote 345 words that brought you to the end of your flash fiction piece. That's oh, awesome. Nice. To edit. Fantastic. Samantha, 208 that time, making 2,473 words for the day so far. That's awesome. Wendy is mostly through with this week's blog. Fantastic. Little pine, littlest pineapples actually going to finish editing this chapter today, which did not look like something that was going to happen today. Hey, oh, that's cool. That's for that. Floor blue, fleur blues. I am so bad with French. Made some progress on your outline, but got a little distracted. I hear that. Sarah might be done with this book. Like completely done except for getting the final proof copy and proofreading. This manuscript document is complete. Yay! That's so exciting. Look at all these people finishing their stuff today. It's mm. like inspiring. I'm so proud like, of y'all. I'm so jealous. <laughs> You'll get there. You'll get there. All right. I feel like did I miss anybody? I I think I think that's right. Uh oh. Very bad books is just thought of a good idea for the anthology. I'm still thinking of mine. <laughs> you, you got it. It'll be great. All right. So I think now it's time to say goodbye to all of our writer friends. And I'm ready. Okay, I got my outro. Well, I, think I, I promise if you falter when she comes to you, I'm roasting you till Tamara clicks in live. <sighs> well, let's start with Ashe to give Dana some more time. All right. Hey, everybody. I'm Cache. I write short stories and poetry. Today, I came to get some words in on Jesus Never Went to College, and I am less than 500 ways, 500 words away from the 35,000 word mark. So, um, yeah, I stream on Thursdays as well at 10 p.m. Eastern. So if you want to get some more words in tonight, join me. There will be a disabilities live stream tonight. So I will have people who have disabilities answering questions about what it's like to be a writer and dealing with those, as well as questions that you guys might have about characters with these disabilities. So definitely check that out if you have more questions um, or shoot me some questions on Twitter so I can ask them to the panel tonight. Anything like that, just do that. Um, what else? Oh, I got a visual poem for Black Rage coming out tomorrow, as well as the 10K Sunday writing vlog. So y'all get to see all our shenanigans from March 30, May 31st and what all we did. So, yep, that's my outro, y'all. Huzzah. I am the Naked Firefly, writer of romance, women's fiction, fantasy, middle grade fantasy, and mystery. And I stream every Friday at 10 a.m. Eastern. And I also host a podcast called the Brown Sugar Honey and Gold Podcast every first, second, and fourth Monday. And I do have a debut novel coming out called The Healer's Love. Um, It comes out in July. I'm not given a date yet, but there is a date. And I believe that's it. I'm done. See, I did it. You did it. Awesome. And I am Dana Gollin. I also write under the pen name Ava Fox. You can find all of my good stuff over on my website, danagollinwrites.com. 
You can also go over to my YouTube channel where I have lots of fun videos of rabbits and dogs and kids and cooking and all that good stuff. So, yay! Hooray! So my name is Kara Brown. I am a room fantasy author, uh, and I have a YouTube channel where I talk wine about the life of a writer. I came here today to do some admin stuff, and I did some admin stuff. But now that I've seen so many of you have like finished your stuff today, I think after this I'm gonna go and write some more words. So. Ooh, y'all have been an inspiration. Yeah. And my name is Tamara Woods, and I talk about books and writing. I'm a cozy mystery author. And one of my favorite projects that we do together is Writer's Workshop. And since y'all are here, and if you made it to listening to me blab on, this is the book of the month. Authorpreneur, build the brand, business, and lifestyle you deserve. It's time to write your book by Jesse Tell. Tebelo? Tebelo? Tebelo. Mm -hmm. So this is the book that we'll be reading, and I will be making a video for that and posting it later today. And is there anything else that I have to... AuthorTube news. Doing AuthorTube news. <laughs> We're going to be recording that tomorrow, so be on the lookout for that. It's going to be and, like a long episode. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be it's going to be one of our longer ones. Because we took a much longer than intended hiatus, but you know what, y'all? It's been, um, May was the longest year and <laughs> we just had a lot to get through. But in any case, it's gonna be incredible and I hope to see you there. Thank you all so much for being here. Thank you everyone who gave me the donations. You make my heart happy. And we will see you the next one. Happy writing. Bye. Bye.